Now, cattle are an essential part of culture for many people across Africa. The animal is held in high esteem and ownership is associated with wealth and status. As this year marks the year of the ox in the lunar calendar, CGTN's Daniel Arapmoy looks at the Maasai community in Kenya, best known for their distinctive cow culture. The Maasai, a tribe in Kenya, would rather get on with doing what they do best, looking after their cattle. The Maasai view their cattle as the most valuable asset in life, going to extreme length to protect them at all costs. Their cattle are a form of currency and status symbol and form a key part of the family's wealth. From dowry to even a friend, a cow to the Maasai is a resource, maintaining not just a people but a way of life. You want to marry a Maasai, a Maasai girl, You'll not, be, you'll not be entitled to have that girl if you don't have more than 100 cows. But you have to pay that girl uh, with uh, a, a 10 or 20 cows. So that you can be entitled to own the girl. Failure to that, you will not have to get that girl without a number of cows. Among the Maasai, the tradition of the dowry still remains a key pillar of unifying a man and woman in matrimony and that still calls for a valuable number of cows. When we are given a girl for marriage, we take cows. We take cows like these ones. We take approximately 10 cows and give to your in-laws, and that is the culture. Cows also come in handy during cultural initiation ceremonies. You must have as many cows as possible because on that particular ceremony, a cows like this, one, like this one, we may slaughter 10 or 7 so that we can celebrate that particular day. Sam Peke, a Maasai pastoralist in Kenya's Kajiado County, says for any Maasai boy to be considered a man, one must have a substantial number of cows to be respected by the elders. For over 30 years, Sam Peke has lived a lifestyle based around his herds, and that's how he intends to live the rest of his life. Africa remains home to an extraordinary array of indigenous cattle, well over a hundred distinct breeds. Daniel Arab Moy, CGTN, Kajiado, Kenya.